Starting with the kick, let's have a look at its controls and its inputs and outputs. So at the top here, we've got trig one and trig two, and two controls that relate to those, A1 and A2, accent one and accent two, uh, to give you a bit of humanization. I used this, uh, not today, but I have used it with um, mutable instruments branches, which obviously allows us to do a little bit of flip-flopping and gives us a little bit of accenting um, in between the uh, two triggers there, which, you know, a bit, bit more of a human feel. Uh, so we've got it connected here to marbles, to the T1 on marbles, which is kind of a bit traditional for kick drums. So let's turn up. So what I'm also going to do is I'm going to take a an output from the T2, which is the or T3, never mind T2, not today T2, and put that into the second trig. Control here gives us a bit more of a click, so we start it at all the way down. Slightly softer kick drum, not much of that transient that you would come to expect from an 808 style kick. So let's turn that up a little bit. Uh, these are not the uh, dials that come with uh, the full kits from MRG Synth. These are my wonderful rainbow style dials. Because of my big fat man fingers. Can't really get in there, you see. Right, so. Turn the tone control up, there's much more of that prevalent click at the beginning of the transient. Shorten that kick down.
down and have a look at the fold. So let's move on to the fold. So fold has uh, three inputs. So we've got an input for the main part here. And we've also got an external input here. Uh, so you can actually use that to mix something else into the sound. Um, and you can saturate it with this dial here. So from the top down, we've got input symmetry, CV. So control of the symmetry dial here over control voltage. F, which I think stands for fold. How about you? That's why symmetry. M for mix, you can see there's fold all the way on the left and external input on the right. And saturate, low saturation, high saturation. So let, let's just start by plugging in this braids thing, which is doing a... So it ranges from absolutely insane, that was a patch cable falling on the floor. So it ranges from absolutely insane kind of wonky noises to just a bit of gentle folding. That's it for uh, this video. I may do some more in the future. God help you all.